students today we are going to learn about addition and subtraction problems we will solve many problems involving decimals today's activity is very interesting you are in a cafe with the following items on the menu you will be ordering some food items from the menu above and you will use these coins to pay for the items you select. Hello, may I take your order? Suppose you want to order a Zinger burger, how much would that cost? That's right, the Zinger burger costs 4.72 pounds. What are the fewest number of coins you would need to buy the Zinger burger? For this, let's think about some arrangement of coins that can be used to pay for it. Now I will give you some time to create your own arrangements for 4.72 pounds using the coins given below in the coin bank to find the answer. For example, one arrangement could be 4 1 pound coins, 2 20 pence coins, 3 10 pence coins and 2 1 pence coins. You can make such arrangements in your copy or through the link given in the description. Remember to send screenshots or pictures of your work through Google Classroom. Pause this video now and take your time with this task. Great, you are back. Did you get to the answer? Now let's make some arrangements together to check your answer. Don't forget to refer to the price of the Zinger burger in the coin bank on the left. Look at arrangement A made with 1 pound, 10 pence and 1 pence coins only. Make sure they add to 4.72 pounds. Good. Is there another arrangement that can be made with the same work? Let's try arrangement B with 2 pound, 1 pound, 50 pence, 10 pence and 1 pence coins. You can see that B is the same word, 4.72 pound but is made of fewer coins than A. Let's try one more arrangement C. With 2 pounds, 50 pence, 20 pence and 2 pence coins. But my question was, what is the, the fewest number of coins you would have to pay for the Zinger burger? What do you think? Yes, the answer is C. That uses just 5 coins. Well done. Now let's try another question. Hello, I'm Sam. I have a riddle for you. I paid for french fries with a five pound note and five coins. I used only two different types of coins. Which coins were they? Hmm, interesting. Let's start by noting the price of the french fries from the menu. Yes, the french fries cost 5.46 pounds. Since Sam paid 5 pounds with a note, she has to pay 0 0.46 pounds with the coins. Now take some time to create your own arrangements for 0 0.46 pounds to find the answer using the coins given below in the coin bank. Send screenshots or pictures of your work in the Google Classroom. You can pause now to take time for this task. Excellent, you are back again. Did you read the answer this time? Again, let's make some arrangements together to check your answer. Let's now make arrangements for 0 0.46 pound or 46 pence. Look at arrangement A made with 10 pence, 2 pence and 1 pence coins. It is made with 8 coins of 3 different types. 
But remember, the question asked for five coins of only two different types. So A is not the correct answer. So we will have to make another arrangement B with 20 pence and 2 pence coins. Does this have only two types of coins in total five coins? Yes, very good. So the answer is that Sam paid with 20 pence and 2 pence coins. Yes, that's the correct answer. Great work students. Today you have learned that many different arrangements can be made for the same decimal value. You can make these arrangements to find the arrangement asked in the question. That's it for today, students. See you soon for your next lesson.